you doing tonight? Dirty old finish the bumpers on the old Yamaha G1 belts up here, eh? Freaking right it is, boys and girls. Well, I got the old bumpers done. I did. Freaking right it did, eh? Get it all fixed up, boys. Leave your comments below here and let me know what you think of these bumpers. And uh, don't forget to subscribe and like too, eh? Why wouldn't you? There's a rear bumper, boys. Check it out, eh? That's friggin' decent. Turned out pretty good, it did, if I could say so myself. Why wouldn't I, eh? And if you don't like it, I don't care, boys. Well, that looks pretty friggin' decent, eh? Not 100% on the front one, but uh, I can't make it wide like the back one because the tires turn, boys, and they're big tires, but it don't look too bad, eh? I smoothed her all off in here and made her all nice and round and gave her the old jigsaw look I did, eh? To match the old friggin' that. Freaking right I did. But uh, it's coming along pretty good, boys. I got the bumpers done. I spent about two and a half hours on this center channel box last night for the old speakers. Because I'm trying to figure out what to do on the dash here, boys, for speakers. I just can't figure out. But I made this thing to fit in here, and I don't like it, boys. I don't know if I like that at all in there. Leave your comments below there and let me know what you think of that box sitting there. If I put two speakers in there, or should I get some kind of pods for here? Or should I get fake mirrors that are actually speakers? Help me out, eh? Because I don't know what the hell to do there. So leave your comments below and let me know what you think I should do there. Because I'll tell you one thing. I spent a lot of time on that the other night. And now I don't know if I even want to use it. Which sucks. Big time. You know? Because I like it kind of open like that. Hey, what do you think of the, the old uh, windshield too, boys? Hey, pretty cool. She's a floater, she is. Hey? Cut that up the other night and smooth her down. Look at that cut, boys. That's a decent cut. Friggin' right. So that looks pretty good, eh? Adds a little bit of protection to the front. The speaker box wouldn't look too bad there if it wasn't for this being off-center. Because with it off-center, you put a box here and then it's off-center. It just looks dicked over, it does. Got my little knob, boys. Look at my knob, eh? She's a little dirty right now, she is. But uh, still waiting for the rope, boys. But that looks pretty decent, eh? Freaking right it does. Why wouldn't it? Why the hell wouldn't it? But I did a little fast motion there when I was making the front bumper, so I'll throw that in here. Right about now.
think of that, boys, eh? Kind of bit of sawing going on in there, there was. But uh, that's how I made the front bumper, boys. And the back was just an automatic repeat besides making the bumper mounts, which was a little time consuming. These mounts right here, boys, because I want it nice and finished off looking on the side and stuff, eh? So they took me a little bit of time. And then, of course, I had to make these fit so it doesn't hit the body and the body comes down and stuff like that, eh? Still haven't decided what kind of subwoofer I'm going to use in there. I got to make it so it's mounted to this because when you open the lid, this whole thing tips back, right, boys? Friggin' right it does. So I don't know what the hell I'm going to do there yet. I don't. Frig, I know I can put speakers in here for the back, eh? For the back. People behind me can hear me coming or going. Going, I guess it would be. I'm telling you right now, boys, I'm very, 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 very happy with the way this Yamaha G1 is coming out. I watched a bunch of videos last night on the old YouTube there and typed in the old Yamaha G1 golf cart and didn't see one that even come close to looking like this guy here. Hey? It's about the best looking Yamaha G1 in the world right now, I think it is, boys. I don't care if you don't like it, but I think it is. Freaking right I do, even though I built it, so I even think that. Of course I would, why wouldn't I? Let me know if you think it's the best looking G1 in the world, hey? Spin around, boys. That's the title for this video. The best looking Yamaha G1 golf cart in the world. Freaking right it's gonna be, hey? Why wouldn't I? Freaking right. Maybe we'll get some more views, hey? The world's best Yamaha G1. The world's most expensive Yamaha G1. Five grand, boys. You can buy her up, hey? Brand new motor, frame all redone, brand new brakes, brand new wheels, Brand new studs, brand new paint job, brand new key coming for it, brand new cables. Boys, she's brand friggin' new. Friggin' right it is. But anyways, this is just a short little video here. I gotta get on to something else over here and uh, get that done for them. Friggin' right I do. But uh, thanks for tuning in for this little shorty here and hopefully you enjoy the little fast forward there I did for you. Why wouldn't you? And uh, maybe we'll get started on this thing in a couple weeks, boys. Eh? Maybe get the old easy mcgo cigarette going and i should take them back too because i'm not going to use them and that's like freaking 45 freaking dollars sitting there can you believe that for some wood should just burn the fire pit boys hey oh check out the new friggin look at that thing boys hey that's freaking decent all magnetized that's decent bought that for the trailer i did so i can see if she's level she's got magnets on her and everything else the old blue point Good old Perry from Snap on there. I told you, he gets me every freaking time that guy comes in, he does. Just cocks me over. So here, you want one of these, don't you? I'm like, no, not really, but okay. Why wouldn't I? Right? But anyways, hopefully everybody's having a good day like me. And I'm happy because this has come along better than I expected for a homemade slap together, boys. So hopefully you enjoy it and uh, you subscribe and keep, keep with me here, boys. Don't leave me, eh? I love you guys, like I said before. Freaking right I do. And uh, you know what to do for now. <laughs>